Get some jelly. Where is your friend, friend? Whoa, no, no, no. What are you doing here? <laughs> I thought it was just one of them. Ooh, that looks like Mistlands, and that looks like... That looks nice. Oh my goodness. And apparently I am being hunted. So let's see how this works. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, it's it's one of the brute thingies. Um, 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 um I fell into... Oh my, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, um, folks, I might die here. Oh no, welcome back everyone to another episode of a hardcore permadeath challenge. <laughs> Oh my god, what are we doing here? Um, we don't want to do this at all. What happens next is uh, something that I really don't want to do because I know I'm gonna die, straightforward, so I'm going there with a heavy heart, knowing that's not possible to survive, not, uh, not on this challenge. So, welcome back everyone to our <laughs> hardcore challenge. Special thanks to Kate and to Russell for supporting this channel and uh, yeah let's get on with it so this episode we're gonna go and try to find the mistlands I have some things prepared let's see let me show you outside if uh, I don't know if anything ha happened from the last time you s uh, I've showed you this but yeah you know about these so I spent a lot of time gathering uh, wisps I think there were around a hundred uh, I don't know how many days but uh, we are in the 180th day Okay, apparently we can't sleep at this time, which means it's morning, so I can only hope it's morning. Jesus. <laughs> so what I've done, like I've done my homework, I've gathered a lot of wisps, as you can see here. I do have some extra ones. Can't see. Uh, oh my god, I'm looking in the... Uh, there. We have some extra ones here. I don't believe we're going to be able to use these, because uh, if I imply the strategy that I want to imply... We don't need that many wisps. However, we do need ooze bombs just in case things go south. In the most horrendous way possible. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah, enough talking. Let's just get on with it. Seems like it's a new day. So we just let... Oh my goodness. Yeah, I, and now I remember. I just slapped on it. I've also gathered some silver. Not much going on. Been in the mountain for some more obsidian arrows. I have the ship ready to sail and it's packed. I have the forge with me, I have all the goodies, I have extra food, extra everything. Oh, this is the last time I'm going to defeat a skeleton, I know it. I am going to miss, miss these guys. I'm going to miss them so much. Oh yeah, huge! <laughs> I think we've uh, moved to a different type of food. Yeah, right, so um, as you can see we, we are running still on the serpent stew. Pardon me, my voice just fails me. So, uh, we're running on the Serpent Stew, on the Lux Meat Pie, and on Blood Pudding, which isn't easy to craft. I needed a ton of barley to do that. Okay, so before we get raided here, in, out in the open, I did have a raid or two with Seekers. No, it was just one with Seekers. So, let's go. I need to get back to the Mother uh, Island. And from there I'm gonna try and, and sail south. That's the only option I see. Looking at my map, my hand-drawn map right here. Looking at it as a... Uh, yeah. That's unexplored territory from the Mother Altar. So we're gonna go south from there and see what's happening. It's gonna be a lot of sailing involved. So if I get there to the Mother Altar, back to the Mother Island, I'll be back with you if I'm not getting lost. Oh, oh, let me show you what's on the ship. Hold on. This is on the ship. <laughs> a ton of food and some extra meat and some extra arrows. Now, these arrows won't do at all. So, we might need to go back and forth a few times to craft more. There's a troll right there. But it is what it is. It's what we got at this point. So, uh, yeah. I'll catch you when we get back to the Mother Island.
And finally we made it back to the mother. There is Hilder. I wanted to go by her fire and rest for a second there. However, I don't think that's a good idea. Given that we might get raided and I have no place to go. We have planes here, we have swamp and a small patch of meadows. So I'm gonna try and keep sailing as along her island this way. And I can see the outline of another island there in the distance, so we're gonna go that way and see where uh, where it will bring us. Hopefully the weather will clear soon because right now I can't see anything. And there's a fog. Oh, there's black forest right there. You can see the trees in the distance. So let's go that way. Hopefully. Hopefully you can get to some sort of a land because it's impossible to sail under <laughs> under these conditions. And I'm gonna keep following this uh, this patch of land until we're gonna see s a different one actually. Oh no! Oh, we're gonna crash! <laughs> oh, whoopsies! <laughs> yeah, this is why it's not a good idea to sail um, in the fog. Well. Okay, I'll be back with you once I find something of note or interesting. So, seems like it's impossible to navigate now the uh, darkness has fallen upon us. And it's impossible to navigate, I can't see absolutely anything. I'm gonna wait here for the fog to clear, like I did in the past, because I need to find a different island than this one. This one doesn't seem to have any, or even if it has. I can't see it. Any mist lens. So I'm gonna keep looking for the mist lens once once I'm gonna be able to see something. Okay, so the fog is cleared. I ventured myself a bit further along the coastline of the island where we were when the fog started. I found some swamps. I can't see unfortunately anything else. No mist lens here, no nothing. Oh there's a serpent. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Oh, I can't have his... I can't have his meat. We're full up. Oh, and there's a leviathan right there. So, like I said, uh, I can't see anything. So, I want to go that way or that way. But I don't see any... Come on. Are you done? Thank you. <laughs> I don't see any land over there. So, uh, we're going to wait for the daytime. Because we're close to the daytime. We don't know where the moon is. There it is. There it is. So we're two or three minutes away from the daytime. I'm gonna wait for the daytime before adventuring any further. I don't want to risk it and go somewhere else or land in the Ashlands by mistake. <laughs> That's unfortunate. That would be unfortunate to skip one biome and die in the next. At least I want to die in the Mistlands. So, oh, but I wanted that fish meat. I wanted that serpent meat. Do I have? Don't I don't have any room in here? Oh my goodness! I'm full up. Yeah, I can't try anything. <laughs> Unfortunately, so we have to skip that serpent. Right, so I'm gonna wait for the daytime and I'll be back with you once we are able to spot something. Okay, looks like it's daytime. <laughs> and, uh... Well, the horizon hasn't improved. Oh, wait! No, no. No, no. I'm gonna swallow my words <laughs> right there. There, there's land. See? Oh, and there's land. And there's land. Hold on, there, there. You can see there are some shapes in the distance. Here we got land. There is land right there. That island is a no-go. We've explored that island when we come for the mother. I have it on my uh, on my piece of paper. But that's new. Now I'm traveling south-ish at this point. So yeah. When we reach into... Mistlands? Or some form of land? <laughs> I'll be back with you. So I've spotted some planes, keep going along this island, maybe we're gonna end up in Mistlands, maybe not. Maybe it's gonna be another island, I know, don't know how far we can go at this point. So, planes, black forest, now swamp. That's the other island that's nearby. And a lot of rocks, boulders that I don't want to be around. And it looks like more swamp in the distance. 
So that's rather unfortunate. I thought we were going to end up in some mist lands at this point. Hmm. How far are the mist lands, though? <laughs> it's kind of... Oh, no, we're getting foggy again. At least we have the wind, so we don't have to sail without the wind. So that's uh That's a good thing. Are those the mistlands? Oh my goodness, they are! <laughs> I believe so, right? It looks misty enough that I can't see anything. Oh wow, look at that. We actually found the mistlands. Uh, I can't see anything. Well that's bad for me, so I'm gonna turn around at this point. <laughs> We're going to go back to the Black Forest and have a small little outpost there. That way we can uh, make sure we're good to sail around this place. And have a nice place where we can get the rested buff and uh, also get all the supplies that we need. Okay, and we made it. So this little patch of Black Forest will be our safe haven. So the plan goes as follows for the Mistlands. I'm not going to touch... I'm gonna be touched. <laughs> I'm not gonna touch anyone, I'm just gonna be touched. Right, so uh, here's the plan. I'm not gonna bother going around the mist lens. And that's a cute little tower I'm gonna take advantage of. We're gonna get there to safety just in case we're gonna get secret. Oh my goodness! I haven't fought great dwarves in ages. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm not gonna go inland in the mist lens because that's how. That's how I'll die. And this is a super cool tower and a super convenient tower to have right here. This is a plot of conveniences. Except this guy. Let's see, let's go. Let's do it the old fashioned way. Come on. Yeah, I've learned a thing or two since the last time we met in the forest. <laughs> and it's a super convenient chest right here. Okay, uh, I need to drop those. Oh, what am I doing? I need I need arrows just in case. Okay, so we need a campfire to have a campfire going here right now, so we get the rest of the buff back. So we're not gonna go inland. Let me finish my idea, because I never do. What we're gonna do is uh, go with the boat on the coastline. Actually, one of my friends suggested this. Can't remember exactly who at this point. May have to look into that. Hold on, I needed more. Just a second here, my mouse got weirdly bugged. The mouse wire on my desk. Okay. So, like I said, let's get the uh, rested buff right here. We're gonna turn this into a small outpost. I'm gonna have the upper part turned into an outpost, not the lower one, <laughs> obviously. Okay, so I'm gonna just sit right here. Let's get the rest of the buff going. And I'm gonna take care of this, I'm gonna turn this into a small outpost. And maybe, maybe in the same episode, we will be able to actually explore some mist lands. If I find myself so here's the thing, I need to find myself dungeons on the shore. Which I know there are there aren't a lot. But we need to do that. If I don't find dungeons on the shore, that means I'm not able to do anything about uh exploring. So let's just grab some wood here really fast. We do have the fire with us up there, so when we have the rested buff, I feel a wee bit safer. Just a tad bit safer. I'm gonna clear this area nice and uh, clean, so we're gonna get it nice and clean. What am I talking about? <laughs> Just gotta clear this area now. Oh my goodness. Na na na. So I'm gathering stuff that I don't need right now. What I do need is wood and a lot of it, so I can get myself a nice outpost up up there. Up and in there at the same time, we're not going to have... I'm going to try and do this. Uh, where are you guys keep coming from? 
I'm gonna need quite a lot of wood. So I'm gonna try and grab myself another. Oh, but the carry weight. Oh, the carry weight is killing me. Okay, it is what it is. So let's see. How can I do this without actually dying? This is the first level. This is the last level. So I guess having it right here. This is safe from trolls. It's safe from mostly everything else. But I would need an exit, an exit point. Maybe through the roof? Yeah, let's try that. Let's try and exit through the, through the roof. <laughs> okay, let's get the roof going. Okay, that looks nice. I'll just need to repair these. And the chest. Too bad I can't repair the uh, rocks, the actual stone structure. Hmm. If I had something with me. And by something I mean a... Uh, <laughs> A stone cutter, so we can work on that. Ah, uh, it also it is what it is. Okay, so we need to do it the old-fashioned way, the way this tower was meant to be. So I'm going to let's get some ladders in here, like this. I don't know. I can't seem to. <laughs> I can't seem to understand the way this tower was built. And we're gonna get an event really soon. Like, really, really soon. Because it's been quite a while since we had our last event in here. Just don't want to be caught on foot when that's gonna happen. Because I need myself a bed. I need to get myself a bed. Like, ASAP. This is rather dangerous right now, what I'm doing. Kind of get it there. Thank you. Okay, now we have a way up. Up and into the outpost. Woo, look at this. The thing is, I can't have a campfire in here, can I? Nope, needs to be outside. Okay. So I need to craft some form of shelter on top of the fire to keep it going outside so we can get the rested buff in here. Oh, I also need... Hold on, let's get the wisp. There we go. Now we have light. Okay, a few needs, a few things need to be prepared before actually going into uh, exploring. So I'm gonna try... Hold on, let's destroy this. Let's get everything... Yeah, we can have a bit of farming in this episode. I don't I don't think people will get too angry with me for trying to have some farming into this episode. World save. Oh, wait. Ooh, I haven't saved in 30 minutes. That's weird. Totally not like me. What I do need is some form of a structure can I get it there? To close it up here. Nice. Good. Same thing goes here. Need some sort of uh, protection. Ah, oh, we can do this. It's fine. Okay. That is a bit safer, though. Not the safest thing in the world, or the best looking. Okay, now how do I get on top of this? I might need to go from inside. I also may need some extra wood. So if we're gonna get raided at this point, I'm just gonna quickly run for it inside the tower. We do have a bit of a space. So the only raids we're gonna get that are dangerous are the Seeker raids. Those guys kinda hurt. So they can't... Oopsies, I got scared. I got spooked by a crow. So, uh, they kind of hurt. <laughs> I, 
I do have the armor with me. I do need... Uh, hold on, I might need my resin now so we can have some light in there. Where is my resin at? Throw away all the resin. I don't. I do have the root harness. That's gonna help us with the raids, and with the seeker attacks, with one of them at least. So he, the seekers deal both uh, slash damage and pierce. Oh no, blunt damage. Sorry. Maybe they do a bit of slash too. I don't know. I can't say for sure. I, I haven't uh, read the wiki in a while. Okay, so we're gonna have. Not that. Please, can I get it out? Because it's it will bother me forever in there. It's gonna be annoying. Okay, so we can have the stone here. What I do want to get is the fire going. Right up here. Can I get the fire going here? Okay, it looks like I can. Okay, we're gonna go like this with the fire. Quickly get it a copper on top of it. And everyone's happy. <laughs> okay, close this up so we're safe from any seekers. I do have a uh, fur cone with me. The ultimate weapon against these seekers. The dreaded fur cone. Oh, I kind of need a bed. So we can sleep on there. We have the bed. Source of light in here. There, this looks rather cozy. Okay, there are enemies nearby. Really? Oh, come on. What are the enemies? I'm going out without being rested. Is someone attacking my boat? Let's just check it out here for a second. I've. Okay, so I thought someone was on my. Yeah, they're on my boat. Look at this. I haven't fought Grey Dwarfs and I'm wasting arrows on the Grey Dwarfs. On the actually Grey Dwarfs. And there's a shaman right here. Okay, what's going on here? What sort of weird part is this? I need to repair my boat. The boat is a rather a bit too close to the base. Please don't get me raided right now when I'm trying to repair my boat. Okay, so there's a lot of... Where are these guys coming from? It's only because it's hardcore or what? Okay, I need to sleep. I need to sleep super fast. We're gonna f figure out everything else in the morning. I don't want to be out here at night. What am I, crazy? Come on, get me rested, get me rested on my... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, finally. Yeah, you can sneak. If you can't sleep, you can sneak. And <laughs> eventually we'll be able to sleep. I just need a raid so we can get exploring. But we need to go through a raid before doing that. Or else... I'm gonna die. <laughs> I don't want that. Right, so where can I get some chests? Can I get them up there? I hate all the dust. I know I've said it before, but I really hate all that dust that's gathering when you build something. Okay, just need two chests up there for some storage so I can delete this chest. Okay, let's get rid of you, get rid of you. We can also get rid of the you. one pile of ooze bombs, I guess. I'm not gonna grab all of them with me anyway. Okay, now I can delete this chest. Good. So now I can have the workbench here. Can I fit it in here? No. Won't do. Okay. I need to go and grab the forge and everything else. I don't know where I'm gonna place the forge. Maybe here. Right here will be perfect, actually. Let's have two other chests in here. Just because... Oh my goodness. Why is this dust necessary right now? Why am I working with such dusty pieces of wood? 
No, come on. Really? Running out of wood already. But I know, I do know where to go to get wood. Right here, there's a lot of wood down here on the floor. Don't even have to farm it. I also need to clear this area up. Oh, there's been a fight here. The skeletons. Is this a burial chamber or what? Looks like that's kind of a mound that looks like a burial chamber. Kind of does. There's no burial chamber there. <laughs> I've checked. Okay. When will I be able to get raided? Hopefully not now. Because I'm in the water. <laughs> okay, so throwing away stuff. Yeah, we can throw away. That's all I got. 26 wood is enough, I guess. You can throw those away. And run back to the safety. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have a lot of you, aren't I? Is there a spawner nearby? I do need to check that. I didn't explore a bit around here because... Yeah, there's a spawner right there. I can spot it there. Okay. Back to our outpost so we can finish the chest, so we can grab everything from the boat. Still haven't done that. I need my forge and I need to be able to repair everything in here. I also need some flint. I haven't brought any flint. That was rather silly of me. Okay, so let's go and grab everything else. Every, every item from the boat. Maybe in the meantime we're gonna get raided. Who knows? One can only hope. So we can get this over with. And go exploring. I haven't had a raid in a while. And I don't want to raid while I'm in the mistlands. Can't even jump. Oh, there's a troll. Oh my god, I'm the worst right now. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, can I get this? Can I get this? No, we're full up. Okay. So, see, this is why I don't like to record these things. There's a lot of back and forth. To get the outpost ready. So I only need to make this uh, strong against Seekers. Seekers can't get in here. They can't land, so they can't damage anything. They can go on the roof, though. But I'm going to go outside. If they want to go for the roof, I'm going to go outside and wait for them outside. So I do need to move all the arrows in here. Hold on just a second there, sir. Okay, all the arrows are in there. We have some extra arrows in here. I do need some arrows with me. Duh. And by, I do need some arrows with me, I need around 400. So let's go grab 400. What else can go in here? These can go in here, these. And, um, uh, I don't know about the meads. Do I keep 5? Do I keep, how many do I need? I think I'm gonna keep 10 at me at all times, so we're gonna keep these. There it is! There's the event! Just waited for it. Okay, let's bring it. Ooh. They're actually in here. Hold on, let me get the armor on. We're gonna get her some seeker meat. Actually, we can wait out the event. Wouldn't that be smarter? As to not waste that many arrows. Yeah, that would be that would be totally smarter. I'm just gonna repair the entrance here so they can't get in. Okay. I'll be back with you once this is over. And it looks like the search is over. They got tired. <laughs> We're gonna get some jelly. Where is your friend, friend? Whoa! No, no, no. What are you doing here? <laughs> I thought it was just one of them. Uh, it looks like it's a big, big boy there. Big boy seeker. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was fun. Now, that was fun right there. Luckily. Well, 
these guys. Let's test the use bombs against them. See, they're kind of, kind of wimpy. They will die to the use bombs. Ha ha! So they work. Good. We're getting royal jelly, because that's something I need. I know that I need royal jelly to get myself the better potions. But I do also know that I'm going to need some other ingredients as well. Okay. Right. So uh, in goes the in go the arrows in there. So we're going to have the arrows in here. We're going to need chest for black forest slash... Oh my goodness. I don't think this is wise to keep these in here. Whatever. We're going to try and go like this. Roll with it. Just roll with it. I don't, don't think I need five of them on me. We might save some carry weight right there. Okay, looks like we're good to go. I just need to go and grab my food back. I do need some two extra chests. Hold on. Hold on. This is not going to do. What am I doing here? Am I nuts? I do need two extra chests. Can I get them in here? Squeeze them one into the other. We can't do that. That is nice. Okay, we're going to have random Black Forest things in there. I'm going to have my stuff close to my bed. I do keep the Poison Resistance made just in case. Just in case. Okay, I don't know what surprises may expect. It may uh, wait for me in there. So we're keeping those just in case. Just in case things are won't go my way. I don't know what's going to happen there, so we're going to skip them gonna keep them there. I'm gonna keep these bombs there. It's fine. We can do that. We can keep the bow there. Okay. Need to grab my uh, my stuff from the boat. Oh my god. Uh, I just realized I may have done something silly here. And I think I did something silly here. Yeah, I have no forge with me. <laughs> oh my god. I got all the food and everything, I don't have a forge. Oh. Darn it. Okay. So, uh, looks like it's time to hit the Black Forest again, because I'm not going to sail home for forge. Or maybe, I don't know. What is it? I think I'm going to go for the forge. I think I'm going to go home and grab a forge. I'm gonna waste me some food and some, um... Yeah, I'm gonna totally waste some food items by doing that. However... I do believe we need to get back home. I'm gonna keep some food items in here, too. Okay, we're good. And the rest is in the on the ship. Yeah, okay, so one trip back home. Oh, God, I just got here and I have no forge. It was no way for me to add anything else. You saw how, pack, how packed I was. In the meantime, we're going to be able to grab some more arrows. So going back home at this point is definitely the way to go. Oh, I'm going to hate this. It's going to take me so much time. This is going to take me forever. At least maybe I'll be able to get the serpent meat that I left on the way. Oh, God. I need to go that way to the big island right there. And follow that island. Okay, so I'll be back with you. Once we get back home, I guess. Oh, no. And we're back. And we have our first guest on the shores. <laughs> nearby. Okay. So what I want to do is eat first <laughs> and let's get back home and look for trolls because now we've seen that there can be two star trolls wandering about the forest at night so let me just drop these items oh come on what fresh hell is this now let's get the whisk so you can actually see something like we're chasing the wisp through the forest. I'm not even gonna bother with these guys. They're not worth wasting arrows on them. 
So I do want to grab some more arrows. I don't know if I have enough obsidian. I'll have to look into that too. We do have enough food, so I just needed to grab the forge and some flint so we can get another upgrade for the workbench. Right, we can have a lot of bound wisps from here. Don't really care for them right now. That's not my main concern, as I said. Ooh, safe haven. But we did find the Mistlands, so we're good on that. Quickly, let me just sleep on it, and in the morning we're gonna figure out everything else. But basically, that yeah, that's what I needed, so... We just need the ammo. F, F. Hold on, let me see. We do have some. Hmm. I don't think I have enough feathers, though. Or wood, in that regard. Yeah, I'm running out of wood. Um, thing is, I should have farmed some wood that kind of slipped my grasp. Can I quickly grab some wood here? I just need some wood for... Um, oh, I, or I don't. Okay, no matter what, that will have to do. Unfortunately, that will have to do. Okay, let's grab these. Okay, quickly, what do I need for a forge? I need for a stone, for coal, 10 wood. I don't have enough wood. We might have there on the island. Ingots. Um, I need, I need. Okay, I need 10 of these. Now let's grab another ingot. I need some bronze ingots too for the little upgrade for the work for the forge. And I do believe I need six copper for the forge itself. Let me check that because I don't want to do anything silly. Yeah. So six copper for that. Two bronze for the upgrade. Let's check that too. Yeah. I have the wood there, so that's fine. Also, I can find the stone in there. But I can keep them on me as well, it's not much of a problem, it's not much of an issue. So I don't have wood for uh, the upgrade. Oh, I don't need to grab some flint. Hold on. Almost went there without the flint. Okay, now that I got the flint, and we can upgrade this to level 2, can we craft arrows with it? Can we do that? Yeah, I'm gonna grab some obsidian with me. Let me just drop these into the boat, because we're kind of full up on them. So let's quickly run for the boat. Grab everything else afterwards. So I'm going to drop these into the boat. We're going to come and grab some resources for... Uh, maybe we'll be able to craft arrows there. I'm just gonna test that theory right now. When we get back into the base, quickly snap a workbench. Need some wood in order to do that. I'm gonna grab some wood from here. That little outpost that we had first time we arrived here. Just wanna drop the ingots in here. These are super duper heavy. And these, and we can give up these too, so we can have around 200 carry weight with us if I I would grab the obsidian with me if I, that will allow me to craft some more arrows in there because I will need a ton of arrows for this those infested mines are <laughs> filled with enemies that are uh, and let's just say you're gonna take a ton of arrows to defeat because I'm not going anywhere near them in this challenge it's a bow only challenge so a bow only it is I'm not gonna use any melee weapon Okay, let's see. Uh, oh my god, I forgot about the wood! Okay, so let's grab some wood here. Also, a raid would be nice. Right now, while we are in the base. I can hear some wolves on the mountain, which means they are close by. <laughs> That's always a nice thought to have in your mind, that the wolves are close by. Okay, I wish I can squeeze just a dungeon in this episode, and we will be able to do that. 
So they're gonna keep out all the... Okay. I'm gonna keep out all the grind, all the farming, just small pieces we're gonna have out of, of those. Okay, so let's craft this, craft this. Can I craft? I kinda can craft a lot of things in this. From level 2 forward. Hmm. Haha. -ha. That's interesting. Okay, so if we can craft the... We can craft arrows. We're totally gonna bring up... Uh, let's see. Time to do some math. I'm not good at math. So, that's... 200 arrows. That's 400 arrows. And I need to come again for some extra ones. So 10 is 200 arrows, 20 is 400 arrows. Yep, we're gonna need to be, gonna need to come here again. So I'm gonna load everything on the boat, and I'll be with back with you once uh, we're ready to sail. Okay, and that's it. That's it. That's all I needed. A few extra spots and a few extra slots. <laughs> Okay, so we're good to sail. I'm gonna sail right back, and of course we're not gonna have the wind. So this will take me, again, a lot of time, around 30 minutes. So I'll catch you back when I get there. And after a long wait, I'm back. <laughs> a long wait on a boat, that is. So uh, we're back here. Turns out that if you have the wind in your favor, this is not a that much of a boring trip, but I did uh, end up counting trolls on the edge of the Black Forest, so <laughs> it wasn't exi exciting or exhilarating. So let's just sleep, and first thing tomorrow I'm gonna grab everything from the boat, bring it here, get everything ready, get the forge ready, and we'll be good to sail. I do want to squeeze a dungeon in the black in the uh, mistlands if we're gonna spot one that is on the forest on the edge of the forest. So uh, on the edge of the forest on the edge of the <laughs> mistlands. At the same time, I don't know how much of a good idea is this because uh, what's with this one? Huh? Oh wait, it may have died. I do need feathers. I don't have feathers. Um, so we're gonna grab. Oh no. There was another one. We're gonna grab all the seagulls and the crows that we can get our hands on. Quickly grab everything from here. Gonna need wood as well. So wood, stone, everything is good at this point. That's why I'm gonna toss everything. <laughs> Except the wood. Okay, so I do have to do a bit of a run back and forth to grab all these inside to bring them back in. The thing is... Yeah, we can do this. So we'll, we'll just talk meanwhile while we'll do this because it's just one minute. Feel free to skip if you want. So the thing is that I need to find dungeons that are on the edge. On the edge of the mist. If I'm not gonna find those dungeons, we're not going into the mistlands. It's impossible. It will be impossible, so I can't go in land. The moment I go in land, I'm gonna get killed. I just know it. Like, I feel it in my bones. <laughs> okay, where's my forge? Have a built crafting forge. What don't I have? Ten wood? Come on, I had some wood leftovers here. That's rather unfortunate. <laughs> okay. Oh god, so now I don't have that really. Okay, quickly let's grab some wood. I need more than 10 wood. Thing is, can I squeeze out all that wood in my inventory? Yeah, we're good. Okay, so we can finally have the forge. Thank you! Then I'm just gonna need two quick trips to the boat for the arrows. Because I need the boat empty. 
So I can use it with a... Okay, that, that won't fit at all right there. So we can have the forge here. But that, that won't do either. Ah, uh, this is kind of tight. <laughs> we can have it here. What am I talking about? Okay, there. Now it's no longer tight. We can have the bed here. Yep, we can totally have the bed here. Up here. Nice. Okay, we can't slip at this time. So the, here's the thing. I do need to grab all the other um, items. So let me just drop these in here. Also, the wood can go. Where was the wood going? Here? Yeah, okay. We can have the feathers in there too. So I don't need to grab everything. I need my boat empty before doing this. Also, I may need a campfire. I need a lot of rocks in case I need to go inland. The only event that I'm actually scared of is the Gyal one. The one when it says the Gyal is... Uh, or what's up, Gyal? That one, where well, you know, where you have the Gyal on your tail. That's the only event I'm worried about. So the Seekers can be easily manipulated. And uh, you, you can even run around uh, with the Seekers. But with the Gyal, that's a whole different story. I can get into my foxhole. I can't keep them calling them wormholes now. Because... <laughs> I got a cute suggestion that I need to stop calling them wormholes, because that sounds weird. So we're gonna call them foxholes, and I don't have the habit of killing, uh, of getting feathers. Killing the birds. Okay, so let's just hope that I can get this in one road. Can I please? Thank you. Good. Now that we have the boat ready. I'm gonna get my uh, stone, my workbench. We also need some extra wood for a campfire. And we're good to go, we're good to go. We're gonna explore a dungeon. Uh, see how that goes. For some reason, I don't think that will go well for us. But, um, you know, we need to do this one way or another. We need to do this. Where's my ooze bombs? Where are my ooze bombs? So there they are. Okay, how many arrows for the dungeon? Will these do? I don't think so. Also, I drank a lot of juice and now I need to use the restroom. So <laughs> that's something you didn't need to hear from me, but still is there. Okay, can I sleep on it and go first thing in the morning? No, we can't. Also, I don't want to go there at night. I really don't want to go there at night. So let's get everything else ready. That is the wood that we need for the workbench. A raid would be amazing to have right now. I would give anything if I have a raid. I also don't need the pickaxe in there. So we might switch for... Uh, might place the ooze bombs in the, spot, in the pickaxe spot. Come on, just need these, don't need to meddle with them, uh, fiddle with the large rocks. Okay, can I grab one more so we have an even number? No? Good? No? No? Yeah? No? Okay. So we need around 45 of these for the fire and for my pillars. How did you spawn right there? Okay, so... We're gonna go like this. Because the only thing I needed now was a troll in here. Oh, now he dies from two arrows. Now that's that's new. I grabbed one extra stone. Go it. I won't keep the hide, I will keep the coins, or don't keep the coins, don't need the coins as well. We'll see. Okay, let me try and sleep on it before going into another dungeon. 
or into a dungeon. Oh my god, I can't sleep. <sighs> what do I do? Do I go? Do I risk it? It's midday. It's It should be able to sleep really soon, so I don't think I will go. I'm just gonna wait here. I don't think this is smart. It's gonna take me a lot of time to get there, a lot of time to find a dungeon, and it will be night time in the Mistland, so that's... no thank you. Oh, I can't sleep. Where is the sun? So it's just morning. Okay, let's just wander around the forest for a while, around the base here, not too far away, in case we get raided. Maybe we'll get another raid in. Also waste a few arrows on them, because that's a wise thing to do. There's another dungeon here. Well, let's just quickly go close to the Mistlands. There's another troll here, is it? Yes, there is. Oh, that's why he dies in two shots. Now, will you die from poison? Yeah, he does. Ooh. I'm in for the feathers. Might as, well, might as well farm some feathers while we're at it. Okay, so just need the feathers. Just need the feathers. For extra arrows. Oh my god, that's another troll. Big head. Ooh, that looks like mist lands, and that looks like that looks nice. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> nah. You're screwing with me, game. You're screwing with me, game. What is this? What is this? You gotta be kidding me. Hey, Halder, what up, buddy? I have no gold for you. I just threw away a lot of gold. Oh, wow. We found Halder. Look at this. I'm not exactly happy about it because I have no gold with me. We may, we can maybe explore some dungeons and grab some gold. I will need the belt. That's the only thing that I need at this point. We found Halder right here? So what, is this like a safe spot or what? Why, are you, why can't they see me in here? Let me, hold on, let me check something. Let's see, can they spot me in here? That is like they're scared of this guy. Huh. So we might be actually safe from raids in here. Maybe I should build a base around him, like just like um, Hiccup. Because Hiccup did build a base around Halder. I don't know the mechanics of Halder. I've not spent this much time in the game, so I know the mechanics of how that guy works. We do need to get rid of some items here. And that looks like Mistlands right there. We are so close. We are dangerously close to the forest. To the <laughs> Mistlands. Okay, there's some... Um, there's some loot. But wow, look at this. It's Halder here. Okay, I do believe we, are able to, we will be able to sleep at this point. So it's good to know that we have him here. We might have... A we might build a base around him. Like an, like an outpost. And look, there is a lot of gold here too. Okay, what do I do? Definitely want to keep the gold. Where is the other pile of gold that I've thrown away now? <laughs> I kind of need it. I have the worst habit in the world to keep throwing away items. Oh, there. Now there's just the troll hide. There's the gold pile. Okay, so we are at one out of nine. We need 900 for uh, for the belt. 
But I do believe we can now worry about that in the next episode, if we're gonna make it to the next episode, that is. Don't wanna jinx it. I'm just scared. I'm just scared. Okay. <laughs> Wouldn't you be scared as well? Try permadeath, friend, and tell me, let me know how you feel about it. Okay, we're all we are able to sleep on it. Oh my god, what am I getting myself into? What am I getting myself into? So I will start sailing. Oh, can I get yeah, can I get off? Just wait for the rested buff. Oh, right, the gold. Where can I place the gold? Can I place Look at that, I've wasted five more days without actually doing anything. Okay, I'm gonna cut it here, and once I find a dungeon, I will be back with you, because this is gonna take me quite a while. Let's have the Wisp equipped. Yeah, so it's foggy in here, but in, in the Mistlands it's always foggy. So once we're, once we're there, I'm gonna find something interesting, I'll be back with you. Thought I heard something, so we can uh, explore it together. Okay. I'll see you in a bit. So there is a rather interesting structure right there. Looks like some sort of a port. Now of course it's gonna start raining, I can't see anything now. But I, that doesn't look like I can get into there, or may, they may be just divergers. Divergers? So I'm gonna keep going here, this way. Until I can spot some dungeon, because I haven't spotted any just yet. And apparently I am being hunted. So let's see how this works <laughs> at this point. I'm just gonna... Okay, let's... I'm curious about this. Which is perfect, by the way. <laughs> Getting an event right now, it's perfect. That means we can have a dungeon in peace and quiet if we're ever gonna find one. I'm keep looking around, I don't see any wolf. Where are they at? Because they can't spawn on the water. I may, for a second there, I may have been in some sort of a plane situation. That's the only way I can explain this event in the middle of the ocean close to the Mistlands. I just don't want to have a Gyal coming right now at me. But yeah, no wolves, as you can see. Just some friendly fish. And there's no event. The event just turned... What happened there? Okay, I'll take it. Looks like we had an event, and now we don't. So we're gonna keep looking for dungeons. I do believe I may have spotted one right there. Or they mi there might be a Verger Tower, I don't know. Thing is, I'm running out of the rested buff. Which worries me a lit... a bit. So I don't know how I'm gonna approach this. Best to be approach this by boat, I think. Because I can't seem to see anything in here. Also, why is it so... Uh Oh, there is a dungeon, and there are Seekers about, right there. So I'm gonna take the boat backwards there, in case of anything, we can just use the boat and the wind, if it's in our favor. And make a run for it. Also, I'm gonna attempt and shoot them from here. As further away as possible. Because they will keep coming at me anyway. Oh, they're fighting something! What are they fighting? Hold on. The curiosity is gonna get the best of me. Oh my god. That was so bad. Can I sneak shot one? Uh huh. Got one. I think I got one. Well, that was a sneak shot landed. And there's another one. Oh wow, they actually fought something rather big. I just don't want to get swarmed by them. Because there seem to be quite a lot of them. 
So they attack the hair? Oh, but that doesn't make sense. How come the hair doesn't... The hair doesn't deal that much damage. Um, one more minute. Oh, I need to do this. Come on. Come at me. If they don't come out of there and I'm not able to shoot them by the boat... I can't get there. Look at the terrain. It's just impossible. Oh, there's... There's one. You know what I can do? Would be actually smart to do to get the rest of the buff on that rock. Hold on. I just don't want to get raided. Luckily, we just had the raid. So we get the rest of the buff here quickly. And we can get up there somehow. I don't know how I'm gonna get up there. Oh, I'm so scared. Maybe after I get the first dungeon, or if I'm get if I get inside the first dungeon, things will be a bit smoother for me. But right now, is that a seeker? That's a seeker. Oh my goodness! Oh, it's it's one of the brute thingies. Um, 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 I fell into the water. That's not good. Oh, no. Wait, 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 sir. Uh, it's one of the brute things. That's not a seeker. Oh, how do I tackle this? Oh my god, I'm not even denting him. Come on, go away, go away, go away. Please go away. Oh! Oh, he's away. Oh my god. Look, I can't even land. I can't even get to one dungeon. I'm gonna die in here. I hate to spoil it for you, but I'm gonna die in here. Can I have a campfire? Campfire, campfire. 12 minutes. It's gonna get nighttime really soon. There's no way! I can't even access that! The only way to access it is through the fog. I'm gonna need to get myself up there. I need to get myself into that dungeon because if I don't get there... I'm in super danger right here. So it's very, very dangerous what I'm doing right now. But we need to progress, so we need those dungeons. We need Black Horse, we need Eiter, Eiter, Eiter. Oh, God. I'm so gonna regret this. But there isn't anything else that I can do at this point. I can just park the boat right here like a good boy. This is not where I wanted to park the boat, but... Oh my god, please don't. There's another seeker, can I get it? Got it. Apparently I got that one. Can I get another one? Just gonna keep it here. Sorry if you're gonna hear anything weird in the background. Someone's uh, using the chainsaw nearby. One of my neighbors. Oh, um, 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 folks, I might die here. I am peeing my pants right now. Oh my god! My god, I can hear my heart in my neck. Oh, why do you have to be here, Mr. Gyal? What have I done to you? <laughs> I don't like this. Oh my god! And there's a seeker right on top of the building. Can 
gonna get it. I hate the fact that they're not flying away or flying with me or... Ooh, that was scary. Oh my god, I can still hear... I can still hear my heartbeat. Um... This is not a good idea. Oh my... Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, what was that damage? What was that damage? It just shredded my entire HP. <sighs> oh my goodness. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What am I doing in here? Oh no, this is impossible. Watch me die here. Just watch me die here. Um, 40 rocks. They can drop them in here somehow. I also need just around two wood inside. I'm so scared. Like, I'm trembling at this moment. Wish you could see me. I'm just shivering. We're gonna take this nice and slow, nice and quiet. Oh my word. Why am I doing this? Can I force the rested buff? That's another issue that I have. I need to get sneaky again so I can have the rested buff. This is impossible. On hardcore permanent, I feel like this <laughs> is impossible. When I get out of here, there's gonna be a gal waiting for me. I may get swarmed by seekers in here, so that will be a problem as well. I don't have enough arrows to do this. Okay, there looks like a gate down there. That's one of those gates, isn't it? Yeah, not touching that. I'm so not touching that. Also not touching that, either. What I will do is this. To kill those pesky little things. There's death around every single corner in here, so what I do want to do before opening one of those gates and sentence myself and this entire playthrough to death, to dead, death, oh my god, uh, I'm gonna open one of these sections first. I'm gonna try and pay a lot of attention. I just know there's death around every single corner. And there's something on top of me. Oh my god, there's something blue. Oh, that's a one-star seeker. Can he get down here? I bet he can. How can I um, damage him? Oh. It 
Someone's suffering there. This is why I brought the use bombs. We're just gonna keep boiling them. At least... This is going to take me ages. Oh no, that's a blue one. It's a one star secret. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I keep boiling. How can I get him? Is it still cooking? Yeah, it's still cooking, but it's a rather slow process. Come on. Okay. I feel a bit braver, right? Oh, I don't feel brave at all. There's a tick, and I want to start ticking that. So pardon me for being super, super scared in here. But it does look like it's death. It's just death here. Oh, no, no, no. No, son. No, I hate you. I hate you. Gun, son, your gun. Come on, we can do this. Oh, this is a large dungeon, and I don't like it. Oh, this is a large dungeon, and I hate it. Oh, this is a large dungeon, and it's gonna be the death of me. Oh, how do we do this? Now that I know that this way is safe ish. What are these trophies? Do I need them? I'm gonna keep them with me for now. What is this fragment? Yeah, seal breaker fragment. Oh, this will be a slow and tedious process and I don't like it. How do I do this? Let's get the rest of the buff again. Oh my god. Looks like I may need to bring more ooze bombs. Because that's the only way I can see this happening. By using ooze bombs on them. I really want to do this for you guys, but... Oh, it's super, super dangerous in here. That is because... If I get swarmed by two or three at a time, I'm gone. I'm just vanquished. I'm just vanishing like a... Just like that, poof, into the midair. I may need myself a week to recover after this. Okay, so we're having a lot of pesky problems here. Just gonna wait for the ooze bombs to have their way with them. Looks like there's a seeker. Some ticks maybe in there too. Now let him cook for a while. I'm gonna wait for a sneak attack. That will, that, maybe that will do more damage. Because they can't spot me right now. So you may be able to use the use bombs. Yeah. Okay, there goes nothing. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god.
and they're just one stars, which is amazing. It's amazing to know. Go away, go away, go away. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. And there's sticks. Eh. Ah! <laughs> no. How many of them are there? They're just riddled with enemies. And there's another seeker right there. Oh, that's a two star tick! Getting away! <laughs> oh my goodness, it won't even die in one hit. Yeah, we may need a lot of these. Because these bombs, they don't only show you where the enemy is. They also shred the enemy's HP like crazy. Now should I get here? Let's get them. Oh, what's in here? Nothing. Oh, that's a gate. Um, um, can I close that gate? That doesn't sound good. Here, have some more. Oh my god, no, get off me. Get off me. That was a two star tick. See my HP being sucked. Oh my god, there are tons of seekers down there. Which I need to get. Kinda hate it. I need to get so I can feel safe. Imagine requiring three arrows to get through them. Oh my word. <gasps> oh. Is it over? I think that it that's over. Once we're full up, I'm gonna need to go back home. I need it to be daytime in order for me to go back home. So even if we're gonna have a longer episode here. I might have lost my way. No, it's okay. Okay, but how can I get there? Can you get past these gates? No. Also, as a matter of fact, I haven't played the game in the... Uh, yeah. I haven't played the uh, Mistlands, <laughs> so it's rather new to me. This entire Mistlands thing is rather a new experience. Ah, there they are. They're just in there, waiting for me to do something silly. We're just gonna wait here. I have a ton of patience. Just in case we're gonna fall back to the stairs. The ooze bomb ooh, the ooze bombs seem rather overpowered. Okay, nothing here, nothing here, just a bunch of guck called Royal Jelly for some reason. Okay, so this area is uh, nice and finished and verified and what is this? Looks so wrong. Tick trophy. That looks legitimately so wrong. Can I get a sneak shot on the Seekers in here? Yes, I can. Bam! We can also get the rested buff. We can drop some of this, because it's a ton of it. What is heavy? This is heavy. 
The blood pl the blood clots are heavy. Oh, it's daytime. Oh my god. Uh, I want to explore more. I really do want to explore more with you. But since it's daytime, I'm gonna just explore a small portion and get back to the base. I need to wrap up wrap up this episode, finish it up. We need to end this episode because I've spent too much time in here and it's gonna be a really long episode. But I can't bring myself to. Uh, I don't know, I'm not brave enough, I guess, to, to do this. So I'm gonna try and grab this section. And in between the episodes, you can rest assured that I'm gonna go back home. Back to the base. And grab myself a ton of ooze bombs. Because the ooze bombs... Is the way to go apparently. I can climb the stairs in case anything goes bad in here. Oh, it's a hidden door. Look at that. We found some treasure. We actually need the coins. Goodness gracious, we need the coins. And black quartz. Oh, <laughs> we might have some <laughs> belt soon enough. Also, my running out of food, so yeah, we're gonna get for, go for the base at this point. And I'm gonna have it's it's impossible for me to end this here. Uh, I'm carrying too much. What am I carrying too much? What do we drop on? I mean, drop the this. Yeah, we're good. Okay, now, very stealth-like, ninja style. I'm gonna go out of here. And try to get quickly into the boat and back home. But like I said, ninja style. <laughs> Stealth mode engaged. I'm gonna listen, I don't wanna have a gal. Unfortunately, I'm not super sneaky. But I am super dumb. We getting out of here. Oh, I'll be back with you once we get back to the base, so we can wrap up this episode. That was insane. I don't want to do that again, but we need to do that again. So I'm gonna need a lot of a lot more ooze bombs than I thought I, I was gonna need. Okay, I'll be back with you once we get back to the base. And we made it back home by some uh, magical miracle <laughs> from the Mistlands. We're back to the uh, Black Forest or little outpost that we have here. Oh my god, come on. Don't do this to me right now. I'm not in the mood. But we're good. You can find a lot of gold in those, so I don't even need to raid burial chambers to get the uh, belt. We just need to go into hell, and <laughs> you're gonna get rich. <laughs> Sounds like a devil offer. It's the devil's uh, offer right there. Oh, this is a problem. We need a lot of repair station for that. But yeah, we made it safe, we made it back to safety. So, uh, I feel rather, uh, I'm rather satisfied with what we have achieved so far in this episode. That was a crazy adventure. I, I was super scared when I saw that gyal. I, <laughs> I got shivers all over my body. But uh, yeah, this is the episode. So um, we do need to farm a lot of more dungeons like that one. I guess I'll catch you in the next episodes where we're going to go and do the same thing and try and not die. Although it's about it's bound to happen. One hit from a gyal and I'm a goner. So yeah, until the next adventure, stay safe, be alive, and I'll catch you there.